Did you know that Orlando is home to the largest public university in the entire country? There's over 70,000 kids that go to UCF here in East Orlando, and yet you probably didn't know that Orlando is a college town. And so today we're gonna to talk to some alumni, current students, and go check out homecoming game against Cincinnati. Let's get inside, go Knights. So you guys are originally from Orlando? I am. Where, where are you from? I'm not, I'm from Egypt. From Egypt? Yes. What brought you to Orlando then? Um, I was actually born here, but I grew up there because my parents were from there. Nice. I was like, I kind of want to get out of my hometown and go somewhere new. So I was like, okay, Orlando. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. What makes UCF special? Just the fact that there's no campus like this. Like it's like a city, it's not a school. And like, we're very open and like, you'll definitely find someone you know and you'll definitely fit in somewhere. So yeah. you can't nice. find that anywhere else. That's awesome. So do you think a lot of kids, once they graduate here, do they stay in Orlando or are they leaving? I'm, I'm not sure about that because personally I would leave. Yeah. Yeah? Because I've just grown up here for so long and like, I don't know, like you venture out, you know? That's fair. So if you're thinking about going to college in, in anywhere in the country, would you suggest people come here? Yes. Absolutely. Yeah, it's a awesome. good time. Especially if you don't know, because like I low-key didn't know at all where I wanted to go and I was just like, I'm going to pick UCF because like you cannot go wrong. Awesome. Like you literally can't go wrong. Perfect. Thanks for your time. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Thank you. Bye. Bye. What's your name? Philip. Philip, you went to UCF? I did, 2008. Nice. Are you originally from Orlando? No, from the Florida Panhandle. Oh, nice. What made you go to UCF? It was where I had some friends going at the same time. Uh, and at my high school, everyone went to uh, Florida State or UF, and I wanted to do something different. Nice. How was your experience? Oh, it was fantastic. It was cool because we were there from here from 04 to 08, so to see it grow now to was like a top three school usually annually. Yeah. I mean, it's pretty fantastic. So UCF was actually founded in 1967. The first year that it opened, it had under 2,000 kids. And it was really set up to kind of take care of the space industry and everything that was emerging in Central Florida. This is before Disney, this is before really Orlando was even on the map. Fast forward to today, they've got undergrad all the way through doctorate programs. Over in Lake Nona, they've got the teaching hospital. It's actually really hard to find a company where people haven't gone to UCF because it's such a feeder for so much that's going on here in Central Florida. What's up? Hey, y'all go to UCF? Yeah. yeah. Nice. What's uh? We're doing a video about why UCF's amazing. So, where are you guys from originally? Um, Orlando. You're from Orlando. Very cool. What do you go to school here for? Uh, computer science. Computer science. Why do you think UCF is like special? What makes it special? People. The people here are just amazing. You know, like they they really bring the energy. I mean, just look around. Yeah, this is cool. What's like your dream job once you leave or once you leave uh, school? I don't know yet. You don't know yet? What about you? What are you gonna do after school? I'm gonna be a programmer. Programmer? Yeah, yeah. Any, any like dream company you wanna work for? I'm already working for my dream company. What's that? Microsoft. Awesome, man. Congratulations. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, guys. All right, so we're here with Josh and Jess. You guys have gone here, you work here, yeah? Sorry. What makes UCF special? Uh, it's just a great place. There's a lot of uh, great community, and we've got really great, not only sports teams, but academic programs. That really just brings everybody of all different places, spaces together. Do a lot of kids start out living in Orlando, then go to UCF, or do they come here for the college? You know, working for the school, I see some of these numbers. Don't quote me on this, but it's, it's pretty much half and half people who live here, and we do get a lot of out of state students. UCF has been focused in the last few years of really having a, an affordable college experience for its students. So we do have a lot of people out of state, a lot of people from uh, Pennsylvania and up north, and then a lot of people from right here uh, in the backyard. For sure. And then once people actually go to school here, do you feel like they leave or do they find like home in Orlando after that? Oh no, they stay here. Most people stay, yeah. Whether they're working for Disney or Universal, like they find something in Orlando that they stay for. That's awesome. Who's going to win today? Oh, we are. Yeah, yeah, obviously. Let's go Knights. We got home team advantage. <laughs> let's go. Yeah. I almost had it though. Oh. What's your name? Edwin. Edwin, are you from Orlando originally? Yes. When I came here to UCF, it was a smaller school. Uh, when I came here first, it was 38,000 students. We grew to 62,000 students, and it's awesome. What do you think UCF does better than anybody else? Combining the companies, right? When I came to UCF and I was an alumni, immediately after I got my job, I got, you know, I got offers from all different sectors, from engineering, uh, businesses, because all the businesses come to UCF to recruit. Um, we have a very diverse environment here in Central Florida with all the different businesses from space to uh, IT to business entrepreneurs that come here to Orlando just to recruit us. So that's, that's what I like. Let's go Knights! Let's go Knights! Let's go Knights! Check it out! <laughs> Oh, 
Uh, so what's your name? Bill. Bill, did you go to UCF? Yes, I did. What year did you graduate? 1988. 1988, so things have changed maybe a little bit. Sure have, yeah. absolutely. Would you say that Orlando is a football town? It's, it's definitely a good football town. Yeah. yeah. Was it this way when you went here? It was, even though it was a smaller scale, yeah. it was definitely a football town. Can you explain the whole space history to people? Yeah, well you're sitting right here on the 50 yard line. Okay. The 50 yard line goes straight out to where the, where the shuttle goes up. Nice. And it was in combination back when it was FTU. When I was going there, a lot of my friends graduated and moved out there for the space program, so it was tied in with the space program back in the 70s. Any any guesses on the final score? It's going to be 27-21. Nice. Thanks so much. What's your name? Mike. Mike, did you go to UCF? Yes. Awesome, what year did you graduate? Oh man, I was Dante Culpepper days back at the, the Citrus Bowl. I uh, went to the first game here. Why do they call it the bounce house? Oh my God, are you kidding me? That first game, we literally felt we were gonna fall out of the stands. <laughs> this thing was swaying, everybody was jumping, the camera's on TV. My dad was telling me it looked like a craziness. Do you think that Orlando is a college town? Of course it is, are you kidding me? UCF is Orlando, Orlando is UCF. From Alafaya all the way to downtown, the kids are great, uh, the fans are great. I think this is definitely our home team, our hometown. I so. love it. What do you think sets UCF apart? Part. Pursuit to excellence, you know, you see up the standards back when I was in school and now here, there, there's definitely, a, the bar has been raised, uh, everyone comes in here, they see it nationally, I think we are a national school that, that deserves the attention, the kids are great, man, yeah. they, everybody's awesome, so, awesome. yeah. What's your uh, your guesstimate on the score for the game today? Score for the game? Yeah. Uh, I'm going to go 35-17. Uh, 35-17, nice. right, we'll yes. see what happens, thanks so much, right, hey, appreciate thank it, thanks guys. Think about six instead of three, you would think. Yeah, I'm staying aggressive. You know, they've been running the ball, football effectively, so they can keep handing it off if they want to. Townsend in motion. That's what they do. They hand it off. Harvey still on his feet. Room service. Touchdown, Knights. All right, so the question of the day was, is Orlando a college town? I think after what we just saw, the passion from the fans and the students that have gone here years, decades ago that are still coming back, makes it so that Orlando is definitely a college town. And so if you're looking at maybe buying a place here because you just graduated, or maybe your kids go here and you're looking to buy something, my team and I would love to be your real estate resource of choice. Email me at info at and we'll see you guys on the next video.